Zebras are single-hoofed animals that are native to Africa. Each species of zebra has its own conservation status. According to International Union for Conservation of Nature's Red List of Threatened Species, the plain zebra is not endangered, while the mountain zebra is considered vulnerable and the gravis zebra is endangered. The Red List also lists Hartman zebra, as a subspecies of mountain zebra, as vulnerable. The mountain zebra is considered vulnerable because its population is low and susceptible to decreasing. According to the Yukon, the mountain zebra has a population of only around 9,000 adults. Though the population of the Gravis zebra is stable, it is considered endangered because its numbers are so small. Kenya is home to over 95% of the world's Gravis zebras whose global population are estimated at 3,000. Involvement of citizen scientists has since seen Kenya mapping out slightly over 2,800 zebras. Gravis zebras are the largest of the three zebra species, including the plain and hybrid zebras. A new technology that brings volunteers to participate in a national census of the Gravis zebra is putting Kenyan on the cutting edge of conservation of critically endangered species. The technology involves taking photographs of the species by volunteers, which are then loaded onto a database known as Wildbook that identifies and gives results of individual species. The volunteers are known as citizen scientists. Citizen scientists bring on board volunteers, including schoolchildren, wildlife enthusiasts, local communities, among others. They are required to take photographs of Gravis zebras to be used in a software that analyze and give results, says Rosemary Wangu, zebra project manager at Mpala Conservation Center in La Aikipia in central Kenya. Wildbook is software that helps in tracking individual animals in a wildlife population using natural markings while engaging citizen scientists to collect sighting information. The incorporation of the technology places Kenyan on the world map while raising awareness on the conservation of Gravis zebra. The species, which originally inhabited five countries in Africa, now only exist in Kenya and Ethiopia. They are considered an endangered species with hunting and habitat loss being the biggest challenges. Involving citizen scientists in national count of the species in Kenya first took place in 2016 in an initiative dubbed Great Gravis Rally. The rally, since its launch, has been conducted twice, in 2018 and early this year. Subscribe our channel for more informative videos.